Could I actually say something? Because we've had three. Um, Doctor, I was going to. I was going to yeah. ask you if you'd like to respond. There have been a number. I. 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 Gentlemen, suspend. Doctor Hill, you may respond. No, I think that what uh, Dr. Wenstrup said was um, very powerful um, about the importance of uh, overcoming hatred and uh, certainly partisan um, uh, division. And it's unfortunate that um, Congressman Turner and Ratcliffe have uh, both left as well. Because I think all of us who came here um, under a legal um, obligation also felt we had a moral obligation to do so. We came as fact witnesses. When I was referring to questions that I'd heard, it was in the context of the deposition uh, that I gave on October 14th, because I was very worried about the turn uh, in which um, some of the questions were taking. And I understand that the point is being made about uh, individuals, as, as you've just said, uh, Dr. Wenstrup, and that these articles lay out uh, taking different positions in uh, our elections. I don't believe that there should be any interference of any kind in our election. I think it was unfair uh, for people to already call the election and to uh, make attacks also on uh, candidate Trump and on President Trump. And I know that this has put a huge cloud over this presidency and also over our whole democratic system. That's actually why as a non-partisan person and as an expert on Russia and an expert on Vladimir Putin and on the Russian security services, I wanted to come in to serve the country to try to see if I could help. I heard President Trump say that he wanted to improve the relations with Russia. I believe we have to. We can't be in this unending confrontation with Russia. We have to find a way to stabilize that relationship and to professionalize that relationship, as well as to stop them from doing what they did in 2016 again in 2020. 